Over the past week, I've been writing an algorithm that detects whether or not a player is jumping so as to translate that motion to their VR body collider. This effectively allows them to jump over objects, and that's the focus of this video here. So I had already written a system that allows the player to collide with and duck under in-game objects, so I'll be demonstrating that as well as you can see I'm doing here. Now, the controllers are also physical objects that interact with the world. As you can see, I just pushed that crate out of the pipe that I'm now crawling through. I've basically used the same velocity estimation code that comes with SteamVR plugin to make this work properly. As you can see here, heavier objects uh, take more force to push. Now that I've demonstrated that, I'll showcase the jump mechanic here. The player, when, 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 when the player jumps, as you're about to see, right through that hole, the player collider shrinks a little to match where the player's legs could be in the air. And for the sake of fun, I've added a little jump velocity boost as well to allow jumping from extremely, to allow jumping uh, to extremely high velocities, as you can see. Now, if you're wondering how this works, I'm basically only working with one variable here, and that's the player's height off the ground. I'm keeping the past 10 frames of the player's height, and then finding the average rate of change. Now, if this rate of change is large, and the player's distance from the floor has suddenly increased, the code can estimate that they're jumping and not standing up after crouching. If the rate of change is low, then we can estimate the player's height will remain constant for a while, and use the current height value for future calculations. With all that being said, there's still a few more minutes of myself showcasing this mechanic, so I'll end the narration here. Thanks for watching in advance, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to keep up with this project.